And welcome back to another Paul's Aquariums unboxing. This is Paul's Aquariums. I am Paul behind the camera. We are unboxing a ton of better fish that have just turned up. This is after hours in the aquarium, ooh ah. What have we got? There are over 50 male better fish in here. I'm pretty sure there's deltas, half moons. I have no idea. I haven't actually seen them. They are assorted. So we're gonna get those out shortly, stick them on the counter, get them acclimatized to our tanks, which are all up there, and then check out what awesome fish we've got. But we've also got a whole heap of goldfish. What are they? They are fantails. And a fantail goldfish is just a round goldfish with a double tail. Sort of looks like a golf ball, but not that golfy. Don't play golf with fish, unless they're the ones playing golf. We have lots of fantails in here. There are tons of comets, and a comet is a long version of a goldfish. Sort of like comet with a long comety tail. Yeah, what a weird name. I know, fantail, understandable, comet, strange. Next, maybe they should call those suns and these comets. But we have lots of comets, lots of fantails, as you can see on the screen. And a weird bag, what is that? Albino Corridorus. Oh, which brings me to the fact that we do have some really nice black medakas that I bred myself. So if you want some black medakas, they're available now in store. Super awesome cold water fish. Look how black they are. And also some, what are they? They are some brooches cats or emerald Corridorus. They're not a Corridorus, look like a Corridorus, get a little bit bigger. Super awesome, super green. Also bred by me. Moving along, we are going to get these out and we're going to stick them over there and check out what we've got. And there are 50 better fish in cups. Wow. Still really, really hard to see them in the cups. There are lots of really, really cool fish though. You can kind of make them out. I'm going to probably have to get them all out of these cups, drip them into the new water over there, which is going to take me an hour or two. <laughs> I know. Never get an aquarium shop if you don't want to work overtime all the time, because this takes quite a while. What we're going to have to do is open all the lids, add a little bit of water to each of these cups, just to make sure there's no ammonia first and the pH is okay. I know the pH in our system is just hovering about 6.9, so if there is any ammonia present in this and you do bring the pH up, that can shock and kill the fish. So once we've checked all that, oh, check out that Dumbo. That is an awesome fish. Look at its fins. Yeah, they're called Dumbos because of the big white fins on each side. Even in the dyed water, you can see how cool that fish is. Looks like quite a few Dumbos in that. But I'm gonna get these acclimatized and pop them in the tanks and then hopefully we'll be able to film them in the tanks for you. And it is the next morning. Wow, just wow. I kinda wanna buy another 50 for that rack and that rack because they are so awesome. There are super, super nice Dumbos. I think we got like about 20 or so Dumbos in here. There are lavender colored ones. There's sea blue, there's red, there's blue. There's ones that look like rose tail. There's all sorts. Just, wow. They're really, really nice fish. These are the systems that we keep them in. We do not recommend keeping them in anything smaller than 20, 30 litre tanks. And a 20, 30 litre tank is this sort of size here. So that's a 20 litre tank, that's a 30 litre tank. Males don't go well with other fish, so they do a lot better on their own in a nice tropical planted tank. These are tropical fish, so you do want to keep them heated in southeast Queensland. Ideal temperature is 26 to 28 degrees Celsius. So a little heater does wonders this time of year because we're just starting to get cold now. They will breathe for the surface, so they don't need oxygenated water, but they ideally do a lot better with filtration. And the filtration is gonna help with your water quality, grow bacteria that breaks down all the chemical waste from the fish. You have a heated tropical tank with filtration. These guys can live up to 10 years. And I know the internet only says a couple of years, depending on where you look on the internet, but we have had customers have these guys for nine years plus. So that's why we're saying 10 years. Look how impressive that, I should have got rid of all those little droplets on the front of the tank, but look how nice that better fish is. There are a lot of awesome better fish. If you want to deal on these better fish, they're usually $26 each Australian. They'll be a lot cheaper later in this video. So what we're going to do now is individual little videos of all these fish so you can see how cool they are and then we'll go from there. 
Where do we even start? How nice is that Dumbo? So all the Dumbos are super awesome. That yellow delta is striking. So if you want a really, really nice fish, quickly come and get the yellow one. It may not be here by the time you see this video. There are so many different ones. So I've got obviously a few on the screen as well as the ones in the background to try and give you an idea of what different finage and colors they all are. The Dumbos are striking. Look at the fins on that one in the background. There are blue Dumbos, there's pastels, there's some pinky colored ones. Look at the red on that guy there. I know, he's not a Dumbo, but he is bright, bright red. That is a Dumbo up above, huge big tail on him and fins. Don't ask me what type of Dumbo that is, but that is a ridiculous amount of fin Dumbo. Yeah, what can you say? They are really, really, really nice fish. So I think we got in the end about 25 Dumbos and the rest look mostly like Deltas. And the Deltas are sort of just like a big showy tail as you can see with that red one again there. This one was a really strange iridescent color too. Sort of got the pastel purpley sort of lime green, I suppose you could say, if that even makes sense. You can sort of see them on the screen as we go. But yeah, there are countless, countless different colors. The Dumbos are just really, really nice. They're probably the pick at the moment. So as I said before, these guys are all usually around that $26 price range. We've got a deal in this video. So if you mention the special code word Dumbo, that's as easy as that. You can get any of these better fish for $18, not 26. So you save a whole $8 per fish. Use the word Dumbo when you come in and just say, can I get the discount for the better fish if I use the word Dumbo? If it's within the date range on the screen, not a problem. How nice are they? There are every single one is different. Look at the fins on that one. That is a really, really nice fish. As I said before, you want around 20 to 30 liters. They are a tropical fish, so you need them nice and warm and you need some sort of filtration. So these little tanks are on a system. You've got a proper tank set up for them. They will do really, really well. That is such a nice fish. The more I see these fish, the more I want to take them all home, but I'm not taking any home this time. Look at the fins on that one. That is a really, really nice better fish. And that one there is a pinky purple Dumbo. Yeah, look at it. Perfect opportunity if you want something cool. I think we still have some female Dumbos in stock as well. But if you like this video, click the thumbs up so I know, and we will see you in the next one. Thank you very, very much for watching. If you want to see any other videos, click the videos on the screen, and we will see you again.